community, so make yourselves known. Join in chat, be nice to each other, but most importantly, leave it all on the field. Let's go! Well, 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 ladies and gentlemen, that didn't want to give me any sound. I hope we're all doing very well. We're back, though, uh, being a little bit rushed today, about, what is it now, five past two my time, about 17 minutes ago, I was at the vet with my dog. So, uh, we're back anyway, we made it, everyone's good, dog's healthy, lots, uh, lots of good things to know there. So, before we get into it, hello and welcome along to everybody, this is Simulation 4 Nation, hope you're doing well, it is Monday afternoon. Let's get ourselves straight into it whilst we load up. Grange Valley is just about to load, so it should be coming to you live very shortly. But before we get stuck into it, as always, let's say hello to everybody we've got here. So hello to Trish, to Chris, to Julie, to Earl, to Mr. Simulus. Welcome along. How are you? Hope you, uh, if you streamed, I hope it was good. Didn't get the catch, unfortunately. Harris, hello. Jake, uh, Jake Games uh, with Matthew, Liam, Dara's here, British Idiot as well. Michael, Paddy, Ryan. Welcome along, guys. Game of Dragons in the house. Welcome, buddy. How are you doing? Chris Ailes here as well. Don't forget to check out uh, Game of Dragon on Twitch. He's streaming, uh, doing great guns over there. Make sure you go and head out over to that one. Uh, Witchy's here as well. Hello to Witchy. Welcome along. Farmer Bin's in the house. Victor, Rob, Elliot, Farmer, Ollie, uh, Tim is here as well. I hope I haven't missed anyone. Brendan, welcome along as well. Hopefully the sound should be all good, folks. But let's find out. So, after we finished yesterday, you may have seen the, um, the most recent Aftermath episode, which went up today. Make sure you check that one out if you haven't. But, I had a change of plan. We are still... Let me get up against a, a dark surface here that we can see properly. There you go. We have got field, we've got field 51 to bail, we've got field 21 and number 1 to bail, wrap and cut. But we're uh, not going to use our equipment because we've been using that a lot. So I've hired some equipment uh, and we're going to go and have a wander over there and see what that looks like. So to get that stuff, we'll take our tractor over. And we also need, that's got row crops on because we need to spread some herbicide on our own stuff as well. Uh, so lots to do. Uh, let's start though. Because I still haven't got any kind of truck. We're going to have a bit of a wander over to the store and get going from there. It's 6am in Australia. Whereabouts in Australia are you, Jake? Hello, Elliot. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Thomas is here as well. How are we doing? You missed the stream, Trish. That's okay. You made this one. That's always good. How's everyone's Monday been? I hope it hasn't been too bad. Always nice to get it out of the way, though. No, excuse me. I am drinking my cup of coffee. My usual... Uh, my usual pre-stream uh, tradition really is to get everything set about half an hour before, have a coffee, watch whoever's streaming before me, and then ease my way into getting mine going. Like I say, seven, 19 minutes ago now, I was over at the vets with my dog having a checkup, and uh, none of that happened. So I rushed back, I got myself in just, the clock on my car was about five minutes late that I found out, so I thought I had way more time than I did. Uh, but hey ho, we're here. And here is our equipment that we leased. Now, can you believe, when you do a, when you lease a, when you borrow the equipment to do a contract, you don't get quite as much money. Can you believe I got all of this equipment with the exception of that rake, which I need to return now, actually. Let's get that one returned because it's not ours. The cost of hiring all this equipment was only $575, which would be subtracted from the end reward there, which I find is pretty staggering. Uh, but hey, we're going to take advantage of it. We're going to take this girl. This beaut. Hello, Farmer Bin. Fabio's here as well. Welcome along, guy. Do I install the 6030 Premium? I have it. I don't think it's in here quite yet because I can't afford it. But I know which one you mean about it. And yes. In Victoria, Jake. Nice. FS17, boy. What is going on, buddy? How are you doing today? Hope all is well. Let's get this other screen set up up here. Perfect, so we've got 47 people in here already. Oh, forgot about that one. Welcome. Hope you're all doing fantastic, guys. Let us know where you're all watching from as well and what you've been up to for the... Are you going to move back to the Let me just turn this around here. Ah, that's better. I need to change my configuration for that. Yeah, let us know what you've been up to, guys, and how it's all coming along. I wonder, do you reckon... My John Deere has 140 horsepower. I don't think it's gonna pull this. Oh, yes it can. It's, it's definitely gonna have a go on that one. Oh, well I can count on you, GD. That's one thing. Death taxes and GD finding when I make a mistake. It's pretty much a certainty there. 
How much is my new PC going to be worth? Uh, oh, I'd have to work that one out. Uh, my plan is, I have a gaming laptop here as well, which I'm going to sell to uh, to kind of contribute to most of it. So I'm, I'll still only have two, but that's the that's the kind of plan there, really. What's from the Isle of Sky, Nathan? That's awesome. When is Shamrock out, Trish? It's with uh, it's with Giants. So as soon as those guys can get themselves hurried up there, that'd be pretty cool. But I know they've had a lot on, so hopefully sooner rather than later. Hello, Nathan. I am fantastic. Thank you very much. Yeah, very good indeed. Oh, definitely didn't just hit them. Nope. Oh, I pressed the wrong button there. I hope. Uh, now, is it this one I go up, or is it the next one? No, we can't go this one. We're going to go and b get Field 51 bailed up first, because I don't want those bailed. That's been mowed down for a while now, and I don't want that one turned to hay. That would be pretty disastrous. Uh, it is 10 past 7 here for me. Ooh, that's the junction I want. You're in Wales, superb! Well, welcome along, thank you for watching Farm 15. Yeah, this this is the narrow road, never mind. Do you farm or just some see I used to farm. Uh, I used to. Well. It's almost a bit too tight, but we'll make it work. And there's a thumbnail. No, not that one. Dagwin is starting Shamrock tomorrow. Is he really? I did see a first look from him. Uh, so that'd be, I wonder what he's got planned on now. Yeah, I know that currently doing series on there, you have myself. Um, VF's about to start one at the weekend as well. And then I've, uh, I think I'm the only one doing a series on it right now. I know FS Club streaming it at the moment, I think. Or just started to. Hey, Thomas! Welcome along, how are you? I think I might accidentally have traffic turned off here, you know. Not much happening. You're playing the FS17 Shamrock. Great idea, Kevin. The FS17 Shamrock didn't get enough love. It just came out at the wrong time. But no, it was a, an excellent version of the game. Alright, so what are we going to do? We're going to swap this over. And the reason we're going to do that is because the mowers will go into this tractor. Uh, the John Deere. So we'll get the rake... Uh, no, let's just use this for a little bit first. Let's get these headlands taken care of. And it uh, shouldn't take us too long. It's nice to use a bit of a different tractor there. This is a course we would never be able to afford this, but it's, uh, hey, it's a bit of a brute. Not all bad at all. This speeds the job a bit. Something different to round bales. <laughs> GD, I don't know what you're talking about. Nathan, when is Cornbrook Contractors uh, coming back? Who knows? The problem we have is that, um, well, first of all, Game of Dragon kept crashing everything and breaking all of our equipment. Uh, but secondly, VF and I have, because I'm obviously at a halfway around the world twin in Canada, different time zones, which means that finding schedule time is very difficult. He is doing a lot of recording and streaming. And when he's free, I'm either typically at work and or um, sleeping. Really? What do I prefer to drive? 7810 with a 5-ton trailer or a 4 date 340 with a 3-ton? Oh, I'd probably say 7810. I wasn't a fan of the 8340s. I know the face just a bit bigger than the um, 70 series, but I love the 77, 78. Farm Sim, welcome along. It doesn't matter if you're late. The main thing is that you made it. Do you watch I'm a Celebrity Get Me Out of Here? Uh, I used to. I don't really get it over here. Uh, it's not on any of the networks. They have something similar, which is called Survivor, but I don't watch that one. Hashtag FlamesGD, Dal. Don't you know it? Welcome along, Dal, by the way. Oh, excellent, Farm 15. Thank you very much. I hope you enjoyed. I am trying to, I've been a little bit late this week with uh, responding to comments. I have been seeing them all, thank you ever so much for commenting. Um, so I will, I have endeavoured to try and get caught up a little bit there. Uh, so yeah. If I haven't already, please know that I will be getting back to you there soon enough. Jump balls in the house, what's going on buddy? What do you think about class now? I love it Farmer Sim. Some of the class vehicles are phenomenal. 
hoping to try and implement a few more of them on the um, the farm manager blog uh, that I am going to be working with. So that's that's the new series on Char on Charwell, uh, which I now have the most recent version that is going to mod up there. So that's pretty cool. Hello, Dad 2020. What is going on, buddy? Welcome along. Ian Forsyth. Hello, good sir. Welcome. Thank you ever so much for stopping by. I hope you're doing well. Oh. There's a lot of bales on here. Uh, if it wasn't for me, no bales would have been done in Cornbury. That is true. That is true. D. Garraway, what's going on, buddy? Welcome. Hope you're having a great day. Hello, Model Farmer 6830. Welcome, welcome. Thank you for stopping by. We've got 56 people in here, which is incredible. If you haven't done so already, do hit that like button. And if you are new to the channel, first of all, welcome. Thank you for stopping by. Why don't you hit that subscribe button? Join along. Uh, we are, if you just joined the stream as well, you recognize that this does not belong to us. For seven, 575 pounds, we opted to borrow all of the equipment to do this. So, which I'm quite pleased about, judging on how many bales are in this field. Uh, we're going to be, we're going to be going for a while. HC is here, welcome. Hey, CTIG, what's going on, buddy? If you haven't done so, make sure you go and check out Chris the Irish Gamer as well. Uh, who I understand, are you doing a lot of Twitch right now, Chris? Hey, Twin Cam and Scottish Farmer, welcome. Oh, you've switched around again. And if Mr. Simulate is still in the chat as well, of course you should. You should already be following him. If you're following me, you're definitely following him. Farmer Brown, hello. Hey Mark, M. Keeley, welcome, welcome. All right, headlands done. Let's get the rest of that wrapped up, and then, yeah, I really want to just stick the. This, this has to go and get the mowers on it anyway, but what also has to happen is the 7810 has to be on that baler, because I think that'll look pretty cool. Run away. I'm doing very well, thank you, the dreamer. How about yourself? What is new in the world? How's your Monday coming along? Hello, Ben Saunders, welcome. Uh, not too much on YouTube late. No, Chris, I haven't seen you. That's always cool. Do you have any idea when Purebec will be out? Um, Model Farmer, Purebec will be a while. Uh, I don't think it'll be this year at all. Main reason for that is that Tom X55 is currently uh, working in New Zealand. Uh, so he's a long way from home right now, and probably, I would imagine, an awful long way away from his uh, from his computer. Isn't it just? It works really well, actually. Really, really nice. My idiot brother today decided it would be a good idea to hook a four-ton trailer on the Massey 135. Oh dear! I bet it didn't like that all that much. It's still very cold and no snow yet, but it's going to snow soon. Whereabouts are you, Dreamer? Because we still have snow on the ground from about a week ago. If you want some of mine, you are welcome to it. Switzerland, that's right, yes. Nice. Never been to Switzerland yet. Maybe one day. I really do quite like this rake. I don't use it a lot because it's not something I typically get away with, but if they're going to give it to me for peanuts to use, um, then we're going to use it. And it makes a nice change. Oh, listen to the 78. Would love to work on a farm in Canada. Nathan, the farms are huge. Some of the equipment you see passing you when you get into the prairies are incredible. Aston Danbrook, what is going on, buddy? Welcome along. How's your Monday so far? I did see there's a few mods out today. I haven't got around to downloading them, but that Vardestad drill looks pretty nifty. I'll have to have a go at that. That does look really good, actually. Hello, Matthew, as well. Welcome, welcome. Great to have you on board.
so we'll get flying through this one. What I think we'll go and do. Well, now that we've got these bailed, I can kind of relax a little bit. I didn't want to turn into hay, as I mentioned. So, give that a little bit of a tap. We'll um, we'll get this bailed up, all of it. We'll go and get the Valtra onto the mowers and take that away up to the field. Field 21. And then we'll get that mowed down and we can start all over again. There's a Discord link. I can stick it in there. No, it's, uh, John Deere 1870. Oh, yeah, they, they are really good actually. Are they just recently released there? Uh, anything left on there? Oh, one more pass. Okay. So, do you know why Rainbow Dave hasn't been streaming for a while? Yes, Dara, Rainbow Dave's been. Uh, hasn't been very well. He's got a really nasty. Uh, Oh, I'll tell you what I haven't done. I need to change my volume down again. Um, he has a very nasty, like, chest infection, I think. So when I was speaking to him last time on TeamSpeak, he could barely talk. Uh, and he hasn't been on TeamSpeak for a while, so he's still recovering. Hopefully, fingers crossed, it won't be too far away. Go, by all means, go and send your best wishes to him in his Discord. I'm sure you'd really appreciate that. But yeah, hopefully he should be back soon. A big man, Jim! <laughs> what is going on, buddy? Um, okay. And obviously, it's been a bit quiet for you uh, for the weekday streamers with Landy Kid's uh, hardware issues that he's hopefully going to have resolved sooner rather than later. Uh, Rainbow Dave not been very well. It's uh, it's an unfortunate absence, really. Okay, what we're going to do, we're just going to let that save. Now, this is going to take a little bit of time, but I just want to lower the volume down here a little bit. Select that one. Just have to wait for this to save through, and then we'll be good. Do I know whether the other maps are out? Um, I know that Shamrock Valley and Charwell are now with Giants. Um... Meadow Grove, in terms of British maps at least, Meadow Grove is still a little while away. Uh, Nathan's working on that one as hard as he can. Hopefully that'll be sooner rather than later, but you never know. Um, and that's pretty much all I know of really right now. I know there's been a few issues with MJ Modding's maps. Um, I have no idea what's happening with those now. We'll have to wait and see. The hill and football ended for the summer, so I only have rugby to do. Oh no, Trish. Oh no, that sucks. No, I've um, I've still got my American football right now, so I'm good. I'm good. Any minute now, this menu's gonna click through. This is something I would have done if I'd uh, had more than two minutes. Sim new. I. It depends if it if the escape menu is on, say this one here, or any of these guys, these menu options. It loads straight in. If I'm on settings, it does this. There you go. It's just when it tries to load into the settings menu that I'm killed. Okay. But yeah, we're back in the game now. Uh, okay, stop. Bye. Oh, yes. The power of the 78 there. Oh, it's struggling though. <laughs> oh, it's struggling. Draw away. I think you can all agree that that just looks better. What a beautiful machine. I absolutely love this tractor. You still, Mark. I knew, I knew you weren't Trish. I couldn't remember what your name was though, Mark. Have you got the model list? I have no model list yet, Model Farmer, no, but there are three websites in which I get my models from. Uh, the Mod Hub, obviously, uh, Yes Mods, and Forbidden Mods. That's the only place you'll find the mods that I use. Unless, of course, it is a special feature, like if I'm using a special excavator, where I will document which mod that is, but uh, no, nine times out of ten, it will be one of those.
That's what, I'm pleased we did this in square bales. That would have been a lot of round bales to, uh, to pick up. Although, to be fair, it looks like they're going to be the same. These bales are the same size. Hey, Ben! Hello! Welcome, welcome. How are you doing? When is a new Roblox video on Shawl coming out? The, new, the next one is about to be recorded this evening, uh, uh, Jacob. So, that one will be... I'm going to... On Wednesday, it is going to be Shamrock Valley. And then Friday, it will be Shawl. So, Friday, it will be coming out there. I might do... And there'll be Friday and there'll be one on Sunday as well, I think. That should be pretty cool. Oh, nice, Kevin. Oh, that's pretty cool. How long are we going for, Mark? Um, at least another hour, I would say. So, until around about 8.30 uh, GMT. So, plenty of time to get a lot done here. I approve of that, Witchy. Absolutely. Hashtag like spike. So, what has everyone been doing on this Monday? Certainly a much faster way to get this all build up, that's for sure. Adam Cornwall, hello sir! How are you today? Oh, we'll get around there, it's a bit slow. So we need to, we'll probably take our Ford up to the store as well, even though it's got the row crops on. Stick the bale wrapper onto the back of that. So that we can get these wrapped up. Um, get cosplay maybe doing the... Or we'll do the headlands on the other field. And then we'll get hide work just to knock those out. And that'll be good. I'm doing fantastically well, thank you Adam. Very well indeed. Just borrowing some slightly bigger equipment today. To try and get the job done a little bit faster. Because all my contracts seem to be fertilizer and baling right now. So... Um, is the season for it. I can't wait. I'm hoping in, in the next growth change, so day three of summer, that we might have some crops to harvest. We need to get that class out in the, in the world. There we go. Been off work as a car broke my knee on Friday. Oh, big farmer Dan. That sounds painful. I hope that heals nice and quickly. At least you get to sit indoors and play farm sim though. The paperwork side is never quite as fun, but the farm sim side is always good. Did you get a car or a jeep? I need something. I'm just trying to find a good vehicle, uh, to be honest there. Uh, something that kind of fits the map, really. Um, but we'll, yeah, definitely need to get some kind of... Uh, mode of transport. Favourite tractor would be... Let's get that lifted up there. Mine would definitely be Marcy Ferguson. Always. Alright, that's a lot of bills. We'll leave you there for now, we'll come back to you. Perfect. Nice to get into a big, fast new uh, tractor as well. Not that given some of my driving experience that perhaps I should be on here, but uh, hey ho. To the store we go. So we'll pick up the mowers. We can, I think with these mowers we'll put them all on the back as well, so we can then turn the uh, Valtra around just for something a bit different. Uh, and then yeah, up to field 21 we go, and then number one. We might even actually go all the way up to number one first. Knock that out because it's not too big. John Deere name! <laughs> I like it. Uh, shopping goes straight over, okay. Uh, yeah, we'll go straight over. I've heard a lot of good things about these vultures in real life. Never actually had a much of an experience of them at all. Only the really old vultures. Oh, 
All four farm bros. That sounds a lot of work for me, but I can... I always like a challenge at some point. I'm terrible at modern though, so I will definitely break that immediately. Nice little interior here as well. That way. That's pretty cool, all four, uh, all four farms, bros. Definitely have a look at it for sure. Need a nice little new run around here. Um, okay, so we want. Okay, if we're gonna go on the back, that's the front. That's the front. So we need to go this way. Build message will come out soon. I'm really hoping so, Mark. Yeah, they look really nice. Do you like myself a massive, as you all know, and that looks like a perfect pack for me. Excellent. Now, quite how I'm gonna, I'm gonna give that a gentle tap. Just a gentle nudge, perfect. Yeah, should I do is? Hey! Crushed it, look at that! Do I have a tractor in real life? Not anymore, no. I used to have, we used to have three on the go at any given time. Uh, it used to be, we got rid of our last tractor about, uh, I think it, I figured out yesterday, about 13 years ago. Uh, but yeah, we used to have Massey's, and then before that we used to have a couple of Fords. I'm working on a class uh, Cougar for FS19. Nice, 20% done, no release date. Hey Kevin, that sounds pretty cool. I'd love to see a good old Cougar in here. AD50, they are farm rally, now you're talking. They were brutally good. Uh, so, like I say, we're going to go up and do field one, because that's going to take no time at all. How's this field coming along here? Yeah, that's alright. It's the field in yesterday's stream, infamously, where we ran out of diesel. That was always fun. Oh, it did, eh, Burn? Interesting. Oh, definitely. I mean, I'm thinking the next next time we have a um, a need to buy a new tractor, where and I mentioned this a bit yesterday, when we need to get a new tractor, we need to ensure that we have the funds to have a hired worker driver all the time because we need to cover the ground, really. Uh, so if that's the case, I'd love to get one of those masses when they arrive. They're really nice. Nice John Deere at six nine thirty. I would have figured that would be the name as well. Nice, a beautiful tractor. Not quite my favourite John Deere though. If I had to pick one, it'd be a 6910. I would say that uh, maybe 7810s are lovely, but the 6910, that was a really nice machine. Hopefully, it will soon, John Deere. Hopefully, it is going through all of its testing, so that'd be pretty cool. Blue Belly Gaming, hello, welcome along. How are you? And thank you very much. Welcome to the stream. Hey, Martin, what are you doing? How's it going? I am fantastic, thank you very much. Welcome back to Greenwich Valley. So yeah, I know Green Bale is working hard to get this all up and working uh, and viable for console. Fingers crossed it won't take too long. And stop about there. Perfect. Now, for those of you who just joined in, we do own fields on this yard, on this map, 
uh, just a few down in the bottom corner. I am trying to desperately save up to get to the uh, by the 107 or 108. 108 is going to make the most sense, I think, this, but it's going to require a lot of money, so maybe we have to take an interim step at 107, I don't know, but we do want to get another field, that much is for sure. Blue Belly Gaming, it is, it is, but it's definitely a great challenge, and when you get there, it's perfect, because you can really see some development here, and you can really kind of work hard to get there, and it's, it's like I say, a very rewarding uh, kind of career within Tom Sim. And Blue Belly Gaming has subscribed, thank you ever so much, my friend, welcome to Simulation for the Nation, that's very kind of you. Great to have you on board. Uh, not number one, number two. And for those of you who haven't seen it, there is a video of yesterday's live stream here where we have the aftermath, so make sure you go and check that one out. Uh, if one of my mods could just slam that into chat, that'd be sweet. Stop. Remember to start from scratch on Old Country Farm now. Oh, there you go. It is a great way to do it, especially if you like older, smaller equipment as well that you can get on the uh, a little bit cheaper. That's always good. There you go. What I need to make sure is that I just turn this around like so. Hello, Ryan. How are you today? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna need a picture of this. That looks pretty cool. Uh, G S toggle. Certainly a much faster way to get some mowing done, that's for sure. I'm very well, thank you very much. Doing very well, Ryan. Getting some acres knocked down now, though, that's for sure. A lot quicker. When you look at this uh, this entire cab layout as well, it works very well. It's just that pillar, you can see everything regardless if you're facing forward or backwards. I like that. All of my mods have bolted. Ha! <laughs> Does look that way a bit. I'm riding solo. What's the the worst thing you did in the video? Is that supposed to mean, Mark? John D six nine thirty. Thank you ever so much for subscribing, my friend. Welcome along. And you have both got your notifications on, so you will remain on the wall of honor there in on screen. Uh, I don't know. Not quite sure what you mean by worst thing. Uh, I've, I've broken quite a few maps before, and I've done uh, I've done some damage to Oakfield, where we had a flood, uh, and it rains a lot there. And then we built a housing estate on the farm in Oakfield in '17. Uh, Shamrock Valley had the huge flood that we've only just come back from. I like to get a little bit adventurous. Around we go. That's pretty neat. I like that. Why did why did you stop there? That's weird. Oh, uh, is that because I don't know. I figure clearly we don't own that section of land over there. Let's try that one. There you go. So we really won't take too long to do this field. Another three or four passes and then we're all done. Uh, and we'll be able to get flying. 
<laughs> there he is. It's like someone someone texts you every time I uh, every time someone I crash and or something breaks. Simulus is here. Everyone say hello to Simulus. Uh, are you are you heading back down to uh, Root and Tootin land in a bit, Sim? Hello, Reese. Welcome, welcome. The pickup rodeo is a little bit American. Yeah, I suppose it is. I'll always have a look at it, though. Hey, Will. Welcome, buddy. Thank you very much. Nice to have you on board. Why won't Grinch pass testing? That's a great question. I would imagine there's a lot of different textures and material changes Green Bales have to make, which is always where a lot of fails come from. So I'm guessing that's where the issue is. Why on earth were you up at that time? No doubt find out later on. Hello Daniel, welcome buddy, how are you today? How was your stream Sim? Anyone else in chat have a PS4? I know I don't anymore sadly. Ooh, get round, get round, get round. That, that's nearly all of it. There's the there's the thumbnail. Just like that, we're nearly done. Uh, and then we'll just spin it that way, yeah, like a soul. Nice and easy. Flying through the acres. Flying through the acres, even. Uh, and now we'll we'll go a different way because we don't get to don't get to do too much uh, driving around new areas. That's a good one to put on. We're heading over to field 21. So we'll take that long road across the top and then come down that way. Happy days. Yeah, simulate has to go on. Biscuit thieves are only out at night. So you gotta go out there and catch them. I don't see the indicators on the back of here though, that's a bit of a, a flaw. I'm about to Oh, just rip barely managed to miss ripping down their sign. I do love this map, just for the sheer scale of it. There's so many different areas you can start in. If you ever, uh, if, if you ever had like a multiplayer map, this would be the one, without question. <laughs> are you uh, admitting that you are a biscuit thief, Mr. GD? Around we go. So we won't take that one yet. So field 21 is probably only twice the size of field 1, so it really won't take too long to get through at all. I'm going to be flying through here, ladies and gents. Farmers, didn't you see on Thursday, are they re-releasing it? Are they doing a patch? I haven't seen or heard of that one for a while. You see, GD, that's what a biscuit thief would say. 
I've rumbled you. Oh, nice farmer bin. Okay, I'll be I'll be very curious to see how that works actually. Ooh, stop, 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 stop. This is a new field for me. I also really like the cycle path thing. And there we go. Let's get the headlands knocked out at least, and we'll see how it's looking from there. Have I ever seen Jukes of Hazards before? Yes, but not in a while. Not the new one either. I, used, I saw the old one quite a bit, the original. But I, I did go and see... Didn't I reserve it for you? Ah, interesting. Okay, well. We'll leave that one, come back to that in a bit. Catch you later, Ryan. Thank you for stopping by, buddy. Have a good one. Well, we'll get those that we have done, get them all finished up first. Just two good old boys. <laughs> this is where I really need to get a vehicle. It's got to reset. When you're on till May, um, at least probably about another 45 minutes, I'd say so. 8.30ish, depending upon how we go. Uh, we need to go and grab a wrapper now. I love the fact I'm running along the road as if I'm driving. Oop. This seems to be growing quite well. Farming, welcome along. How are you doing today, sir? Great to have you on board as usual. Let's lower you down. Oh, that was already down. Uh, we've got row crops on here, but it'll do. No worries, Martin. Thanks for stopping by, buddy. See you later. A week today, we're having a muck-up day and all the farming loons are taking straw bales. <laughs> nice. Hey, Mark, I am... Uh, I am quite the athlete, thanks to Greenwich Valley, it would seem. Oh, Blue Belly, you're not wrong. This is a beautiful pack. I absolutely, as you can see, this has got nearly 17 hours on the clock right now, which in farm sim standards is pretty darn good. Pretty darn good indeed. But yeah, I love this little tractor. It looks a bit, a little bit silly with the uh, row crops on, but hey ho. The fact that you can put them on is always great. Hey Drew, what is going on buddy? How you doing today? <laughs> Never has a true word been spoken. Mods can be very hit or miss. That's for sure. But yeah, this one is a gem. And I love the two wheel drive version. I don't know why. The, the four wheel drive version is all good and everything, but... This just suits being two-wheel drive. It's funny because we had four-wheel drive versions. You'd think I'd prefer that one, but, but no. Agri Farm videos. Hello. How are you today? Welcome along. So we'll stick the wrapper onto this. We'll go back to that first field. There we can put the rake back onto the John Deere. 
Uh, go and do that far field as well. We might actually bring the vulture down. We might just go take both bits up there and, and get it done in one one hit. Uh, Mark, we'll be going for a while yet. About another 40 minutes or so. We'll see how we're feeling at that stage. If we've got plenty of work left to do as well, we can always go a little longer. I might actually also... I might leave field 21 until uh, after we've done some of our crop work as well. Absolute farming, hello! The GoPro farmer, ah! Okay, I, at least I hope that's the GoPro farmer, that's what you mean. Welcome along, buddy. Great to have you back on board. Didn't you PC blow up? Oh no! How? How did you PC blow up? Let's get this wrapping done. And we'll use that Accusen uh, stacker as well. For anything that's going to the contract, to the field, we'll use that. Uh, because it'll allow us just to kind of get that done nice and quickly. Anything that needs to be left, we'll use for our own uh, benefits, really. Yeah, I'm starting an adventure. Nice! What's my favorite season? Um, I like late summer when you're harvesting there's still good light out there but the sunlight looks incredible so late summer would be a favorite um, for sure yeah I would say probably late summer whenever you get into a map for the first time with seasons it's always interesting to see what it looks like because typically it's gonna be all stripped out of any of its uh, foliage so it looks a little bit bare but that kind of can really tell you how good a, 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 a map looks in my mind you're getting a motocross bike? Well, that's pretty sweet. Oh, we get a Satex side plan. I still don't have one. Um, maybe one day. But right now I have a nice joystick setup, which, so I don't really need the side panel. Is Shamrock coming out? Yes, true. Shamrock is with testing with Giants right now, so hopefully soon. Just as long and as soon as they those guys can get through it all, really. I love the engine sounds on this tractor. It's really nice. And in we go. There's a lot of bales in here. Heavens. Oh, and the PS4. That's a good idea. Definitely. There's as many bales here now. They're all 4,000 liters, so they're the same size as a uh, as a round bale. Which is, I don't know if that's because of the way the contract's working, maybe, I suppose. Yeah, Drew, 4D has really got on it these days. That's going to be great for you console guys. Which I'm pleased about, because yeah, we do need some of his mods on console, for sure. We'll do a headland now with this, I think. We'll get this all done, and then we'll... Uh, We'll go and take care of the other field as well. Yeah, it'd be great if kind of console players see a bit of an uptick in uh, mods coming up soon. That'd be really awesome. Hopefully Greenwich comes out. You never know, Drew. I'm sure Greenbell's still working hard on that. Might be the dream. 
That would be the dream. This is where you could do like a live stream time lapse just to fly through these. Not quite the thing. Oh, Ian, you're joking. That's a pity. Uh, it will be yes, John Deere. It's coming. It just needs to uh, go through Giant's testing. It'll probably fail on something, then go back. It's a shame about Black Sheep Modern's pack, though, because that was looking really good. What are these lines up and down the field? Those lines are part of a soil texture pack from Nismo that I use. Um, so it's a different drilling texture, really. How many YouTubers have Shamrock, Mark? Um, myself. Landy and Rainbow Dave, but obviously they haven't been doing anything of late for various different reasons. Uh, I know FS Club has it. Dagwin has it. Virtual Farmer has it. I don't know after that. Just finished wrapping 100 bills. Oh, I bet it does take a while. I can imagine. Well, what we'll do, like I say, we'll get the first headland of these guys. We'll take the rake away and do that work first. Let's see how that all looks. Uh, do that one. When the seasons come to console, Barry, welcome along, Barry. Um, it's going to take a while, I think. It's still trying to get through testing there. There's been various different reports and stories based upon who you listen to and what you watch. But uh, uh, Virtual Farmer was saying yesterday that he still doesn't think it's going to be before Christmas. I'm going to go off what he says based on how much he, time he spends with the Giants team. But hopefully it's sooner rather than later. The thing is with seasons, and I mentioned this yesterday... They, it has to be 100% perfect when it's ready for console because they can't easily update it. Uh, it takes a lot of effort to, you have to create a whole new version, like patch for the game. So they're reluctant to do that. So they want to make sure it's completely finished and stable and then they can update it. Now moving forward, let's say FS21, I'd love to see seasons in there as standard. A hundred silage bills equals 144,000. Wow, Farmer Bin. That is, that is an awful lot of money. Was that with Seasons? Or, or if you're on console, it'll be without Seasons, I suppose. I know Seasons does bring down the price a little bit, but that's a great payday right there. Is that like a... No, that's a shame. Uh, okay, let's just... Uh, Barry, hopefully as soon as it, it's with Giants, so as soon as they get it past testing there, it'll be ready to roll. So that could be... That could be tomorrow, it could be two weeks, it could be anywhere in between, who knows. Um, hopefully sooner rather than later, obviously, but we just don't know really. Harry Miller is here. What is going on, Harry? Welcome along, buddy. How you doing? Okay. So, field number one is going to take no time to do. But we might see if it looks like I can't get the grass mower to, or the triple mowers to mow field 21 down, so we might see what it was, what, uh, I don't know, we'll have to think about that one. But we, we can definitely go and get ours done. We've got 4,000, 400,000 for silage. Mark, that's a great way to get some money coming in. Yeah, I might have to look into that. I do... I have a lot of silage bales at the yard ready to go, um, so I'm definitely I'm, I'm waiting with seasons there as we see. <laughs> silage, waiting for the glory days over here. Um, 
to the point where we get a little bit more money, but yeah, it's that's definitely a, a must. Hello, Colin. Welcome, buddy. How are you today? Thanks for stopping by. Yeah, sixty-nine ten for console would be would be really good, Drew. Excuse me, people. Don't mind me. Just rallying through your uh, house and state. Oh, I have seen pictures of that one actually. Yeah, that'd be interesting. Okay. Uh, straight over here. Lovely. How do you know how high the prices on the bar chart? Uh, I can show you, Mark. 66 Little Farmer, hello, welcome along. Thank you for stopping by. How is your Monday? Uh, this is the price up the here on the left hand side. Oh, I'm gonna crash, gonna crash, stop. Uh, so yeah, this is the price up the side here and that kind of, um, this is pounds and it obviously varies throughout the uh, course of the year across any different product there. Hey, great time to sell soybeans if I had any of those. Wheat and barley is on the way down, unfortunately. Try to get some of ours sold in the autumn and the winter there. Uh, get the best start. Eggs are doing alright. Eggs I might try and sell tomorrow, actually. I've got a few of those floating around. Kids have been plowing. Oh, nice 66. What are you driving? What's your machine of choice? We are, you catch us as we're just going to rake up, uh, bring up the map here. We've mowed down field one and we're heading over there with a the rake to go and get that all raked up. And then the baler and then we'll be bringing in the, the wrapper as well. So we're making some good progress. It does? Okay. Well, it gives you an indication at least of where, it'll, where it could be. A 7710, beautiful. What a machine. Whereabouts in the world are you, 66? Oh, excellent, Alex. Wonderful news. Welcome back along. Man, get this, uh, get this guy washed down. You just got a brand new JCB Tay Handler. Sweet! Which model did you go for? And 66 is in Somerset. Fantastic. Well, guys, as I always like to say, if you have any photos or any media of your real life farming, you can stick them into my Discord there. I always like to see what's going on there. Nice, Harry. Nice. I wish we had something like that in uh, in game here. That'd be pretty sick. Maybe we can hope one day. Now this field really won't take too long to get raked up.
Uh, it's alright, Alex. The main thing is he made it right now, so that's always good. With all four corner jacks, that's a heck of a uh, cut tele handler. Alright then, cruising along nicely. We might even, as soon as we get this field raked up, we might return the rake just because we can't can't use it on the current if we're going to have to get a bigger mower anyway. Uh, although we may just lease a bigger mower, we'll see how much that costs. Because that field 21 is quite sizable for my little pottinger. I don't have, or do I? I could stick a, I could lease a front mower, stick it onto there. Hello Jim Bob! Welcome, welcome, welcome. How are you doing today? Thank you for stopping by. I have not seen it actually, Alex. No, I'm a few behind on his work. Uh, I need to get caught up someday. Maybe that's uh, something I can do this evening. Is the Polish mods coming to Xbox? Uh, Mark, I'm really not sure about that. I probably would say no at this stage, but you never know. Hello, Chrissy as well. Welcome along. How are you doing today? Ah, Dara, that makes sense. Yeah, you want something with the, the stability and the capacity to do that, for sure. Jim Bob got a new tractor as well. Everyone's getting new equipment. This is great. What did you get, Jim Bob? One thing I do like about this rake, it does lift much higher than the swath, so you never get that problem with the rotor rakes where it clips the edge of the headlands all the time. This one is easy. What have I been doing in real life today? I've had a day off today, so my day has been full of admin. Uh, I did a, a recorded Shamrock Valley for Wednesday. Uh, been getting a few things ready for the next episode of the Farm Manager Blogs. Uh, which will be recorded this evening, hopefully. Played a little Red Dead, took my dog out to the vets. Just a whole load of things. And it lifts up very quickly as well, actually. From that respect, it's a far superior uh, rake from some of the rotor rakes that we have. New Holland T7200 for a, a K240. Oh, nice, Jim Bob. That's pretty cool. One more pass should about do it, I would think. Perfect, sir. Are you doing a face cam? Uh, my idea, Mark, was always that we do a face cam when I get to 10,000. That will be the big, uh, the big reveal. So we're not far away. We're about 8,000-ish now, give or take. Uh, we'll hit 8,000, hopefully sooner rather than later. So that after that. Then we'll uh, we'll see. But yeah, so a little bit away. Um, okay, so back we go. And Alex, you got your new sixty-one thirty R in April. That's fantastic. Getting new equipment is always good, regardless of the shape or size or brand of it. The reason for a farmer bin, this is, I got all this equipment, you're quite right, that would have made more sense. I got all this equipment by borrowing it when I do the uh, contracts. So when I go into here, when I accept this contract, you know how you can borrow the equipment to do it? 
that's the equipment they offered me. So it wasn't any of the, uh, I didn't get the option in what equipment it was really. But otherwise, yeah, that would be a great idea. What breeds my dog, Adam? I have a Boston Terrier. She is 13 years old. So she has to go for a checkup because she's an old lady. Oh, that'd be pretty cool, Ian. That's no worries, probably. No worries at all. But no, that'd be really sweet if they gave me a major mower instead. That'd be pretty nice, but uh... I know. It's nice just to use different equipment anyway, just to save me from mower mowing every grass field, it seems like, with the same uh, equipment there, so... Uh, that's always pretty cool. But uh, yeah, we'll, what we'll do is we'll... We'll send this back, and depending upon that one field, we'll see how much it costs us. Because it's probably going to cost me less to borrow the equipment as part of the mission, as it would to um, have to use it all myself. So we'll see. Uh, but we're going to always look into that. Landy boy, hello, good sir. How are you? I am fantastic, thank you. Hello, Rowan, as well. Welcome along to the stream. How is your Monday evening going? Up the hill, come on. Listen to the power. Uh, one month ago we had a new cow shed built. Oh, that's pretty cool, Jim Bob. How many cows can get inside that one? What's the scariest thing that's ever happened to me? Uh, I don't know. I'm going to the next one over. Uh, let's leave this down here anyway, because we'll have a think about that. Scary signals ever happened, I have no idea. I'll have to have a think about that. I was in a car crash when I was a lot younger. That's never fun. Adaboo, hello! Welcome to the stream, how are you doing today? Thanks for stopping by. Uh, do you know what? Despite everything I've said, I'm going to leave this rig here so we can come back and use it in a bit. I'm sure someone won't, random farmer won't mind if I just drop a rake off here. Lovely. Stephen Lee's here as well. Hello, Stephen. How are you doing today? What age am I, Mark? I am 32. Fantastic, Stephen. Excellent news. Um, so I need to take that next right. Next left, sorry. Could you do merch for Christmas? I don't know if there's enough demand there for it, in all honesty. If, the, if people genuinely wanted it, I could think about it. But I don't think there's... Uh, you're the first person who's ever asked me, Ian. Uh, so I don't know if enough people would want it. Oh, it's been a terrible autumn, Adabu. Absolutely. Really, really difficult. And s some of the poor farmers in the, across the UK and Ireland are really being crippled by the rain at the moment. Not a hope of getting anything in the ground. Nearly being run over by a bull. Alex, I don't blame you. My When we had our... our, our uh, the three farms going. Uh, my uncle ran one of them, uh, or lived on one of them and worked on the, that one. Uh, and he once got his knee, he got his hip kicked out by a cow, and then he had that, got it all healed and replaced, and then um, another cow did the exact same thing to him about four months later. Mark would buy some merch. Interesting. I would have to think about it for sure. 
Uh, see what options are out there. What the question would be, what would you want? What would you buy? That's always intri intrigued me, really. Uh, right, you're going to go and do some bailing, but we'll just do a, wrap a few more bales as well. Just to kind of break the back of that a little bit more. Well, that hasn't been great in Kent, South East UK, but the north of Suffolk, yeah. And I hear likes of uh, Leicestershire and Lincolnshire have really been crippled. Uh, really just struggling to get anything done. Oh, Jimbo, that's brutal. Hello, Grant. Welcome, welcome. How are you today? Yeah, logos work well. Mark, your granddad had five. Wowzers. That's a lot. Oh, jeez. Yeah, cows, they can really, uh, they can really get after you if you're not careful. That's definitely for sure. Oh, come on, get in there. There you go. Alright, so we're going to take this one, two, three, four, five, six, seven bales. There's quite a few, but we're not going to do them all now. We're going to do this little block here. We'll take the baler away to the other field. And then we'll come back and we'll do a few more. Because wrapping takes a little bit of time. I like to break them up a little bit. Because then once we have that field baled, we can go and get the bale wrapper. Uh, let's just line that one up. Get the bell wrapper on board and then we're laughing. Out on the farm, hello! Welcome along, how are you today? Hope you're doing very well. They are different grass textures, yes, this is a combination of the forgotten fruits grass textures but also the uh, soil textures by Nismo, which kind of make the Make it look a little bit different there. Oh, come on. There you go. Jim Bob, it's been a pleasure, my man. Enjoy. Remember to take photos, stick them into the Discord. It's always a good thing to do. I might make a separate channel for uh, real life farms or something like that. That'd be a good idea. Oh, I'm really struggling to get lined up with these today for some reason. Yeah, if you go near the new cows, Alex, or the new calf, sorry, they will want to be a little bit protective there. Uh, so these sort of textures are by Nismo. You can get them on Forbidden Mods. When I was about... I, when I was really young, I didn't do a lot of work with the cattle. I did a lot. I do I did a lot more work with sheep than with cattle. Uh, when I was probably about seven, I had a, a, a tup run at me and uh, headbutt me. That was interesting. Solid Rizzo, welcome along, buddy. How are you doing today? And Michael Barnes is here as well. Welcome, sir. I haven't quite got the new PC yet, Michael. We're working towards it. Um, but my current PC that I have is pretty awesome. How are you doing today, Michael? Join to update the class, you'll see the need to put yellow Lexi in here. Yeah, maybe. Quite possibly. Tremendous, thank you, Solid. Yeah, cannot complain. One ounce here. Uh, we've been, there's a, an awful lot of bales here right now that we're just trying to get through so we're going to wrap up this uh, these two here and then we're going to go away and bale some more in another field and then come back come back with a bale carry as well because that way we can get these all kind of bailed up and shipped out of here it is a big wish list yes now I don't uh, expect uh, best way of essentially the wish list was me just kind of documenting what's going to go inside that uh, computer now when we get close to it 
I am actually going to buy all... I'm going to sell my uh, gaming laptop that I have. And that's going to fund the majority of it. So if you're in the market for uh, a gaming laptop with the uh, GTX 1050 Ti uh, graphics card, I might be the man for you. Classic moving away from the yellow US colors. That is very true, Adabu. Yeah. Trying to someone should get the T614 New Holland into FS19. Adam, I don't know. Yeah, they... We might see like a, a refresh. Maybe for, uh, I'd like to see what they do with the current, with what we classify as like the older brands. I'd like to see what they would do with their in game with them. Uh, moving forward, that is. So I guess we'll have to see on that front. Okay, so we'll pick that one up. So I guess there's only like half the bills left there, maybe. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Okay. Hello, Nikki Gooden. Welcome along. A short wheelbase New Holland T7 would be great. Would be very nice to see. How are you, Nikki? Welcome along this evening. Hope everything is going well. Um, are in agri videos? I don't actually know. Uh, to put it into some perspective, when I bought it, I bought it for about fourteen hundred dollars Canadian. Um, so it probably wouldn't be going for. It wouldn't be going for a thousand. Um, I don't know, maybe eight, nine hundred. I don't know. We'll have to see. Silage 2020 is always going to be. Silage at any time of the year is going to be. Oh, any year is going to be good. But I do like to see everyone's uh, images as they get through in silage, get cracking along. That's always good fun. Harry, it's been a pleasure, my friend. Thank you for stopping by. Hope you have enjoyed. We'll see you in the next one. Don't forget guys, if you haven't done so already, there's 55 people in here. If you haven't hit that like button yet, smash that like button. Smash it out the ground. Uh, make sure you hit that subscribe button as well if you are new to the channel. Come and join John Deere 6930 um, Blue Belly Gaming as well. Who have uh, been fantastically awesome today and subscribe. Farmer Bin, that's valid. I'm very intrigued by what that uh, what that's going to look like in terms of its its output. I feel like for a new for a new um, oh I'll let you cross for a new PS5 though I probably need a new TV to play it just to get the best you know. What are we doing, Nikki? We're bailing silage. We are bailing our silage. We're doing contract jobs today. Uh, I'm being stuck going through a detour at the moment, which is never ideal, but such is life. Uh, and then yeah, we're on to the we've got one small field. We're going up to field number one in the very top left corner uh, And then we'll be that's it done for bailing right now Another big field there shouldn't be too many bales on it, but it'll give us uh, it's a contract job So we'll get paid quite well for it. Oh, I can't stop in time there. Sorry, sir uh, I think it's next this time next year actually Adabu. It's a while away. Oh wow, look at the time already. We're flying along. So, we'll get this one bailed up and then we'll try and... We'll go for at least another 15 minutes, I should think. I've got some other recordings I need to try and get done today, so we can't stay too, too long. Kieran, I don't know if I saw you there. Welcome along, Kieran. How are you doing today? Class of the deal with Challenger, which allowed Challenger tractors, uh, sort of class colours. Ah, yeah, that makes sense. Alright, I'm assuming that, like, agreements run out. And before he doesn't record, the plays Red Dead too. <laughs> well, I've got to allow for some Red Dead time as well, so... Alex, thank you ever so much, buddy. You're gonna have yourself a great day. We'll catch you in the next one. What chapter am I on in Red Dead Adibu? I have 
I've finished, I've moved to the second camp. Um, I think that's end of chapter three or middle of chapter three I'm in now. Uh, but I've done an awful lot of like stranger missions and I'm just not doing any more real missions right now. I'm just doing like exploring the map and going hunting and doing all those little side missions that you find. Hey Paul, what is going on buddy? How are you? What tractors do you have? I can show you Nikki. We have this John Deere 7610. This one is ours. We own this one. So it's seven hours on the clock so far. Uh, I have one other tractor as well, which is a Ford 7840 two-wheel drive, which has 16 hours. And is a real workhorse for me. Uh, it's a great machine. So yeah, this one is just going to get this little field all built up nice and quickly. Exactly, Adam. If, as long as there are good mod creators out there willing to get their work onto PC, such as... Uh, Oxy and Green Bell, then you're going to be doing alright. Farmer15, you have yourself a great day. Thank you for stopping by, buddy. Really do appreciate that one. Enjoy the rest of your week. Alright then. So yeah, I think we'll get this field done, and then we might call it a day after that. We'll see how we're looking for time. You placed a Christmas tree on Oakfield? Nice. First time I played it, I plowed through the story missions, played it a second time, took it really slowly. Exactly. And because I can, I'm... A sim knows too well. I'm having a bit of a, a one-man fight against, uh, against a certain get a rival gang. And I'm really enjoying where that's taking me at the moment, so we'll continue with that. Also doing a lot of gold bar missions as well, where I can try and find hidden gold bars. That's pretty cool. That's as that actually. Hello to you. Wow. Whereabouts did you place the Christmas tree pole? Quite a few bales on here as well, I suspect. Is that true, Farmer Vin? I never knew that. Interesting. Cool. Like this. Oh, nice, Paul. Yeah, that makes sense. This. The sheer size of the map on Red Dead Redemption is staggering, absolutely staggering. Holly, hello, welcome along buddy. How are you? What's going on in the world? So I must have leased the equipment for this field, which is why it wouldn't let me start field 21 with it, which makes sense. How do I play realistic on FS? I, I try and bring in as much of my kind of real life knowledge really. I was a farmer before. Uh, many years ago, so I try and bring that in. Uh, that, that's always helped. There's plenty of different scripts out there as well that can allow you to be as realistic as you choose to be. Nice farmer bin. I've never, excuse me, never played Skyrim. That was never my thing. So, but that's interesting to know. How long is that mark? I would say about until we get this field bailed up, really. We'll stop then, so uh, maybe five minutes. A farm worker's son, exactly. That's pretty cool. Yeah, you can take the boy off the farm, but you can never take the farm out of the boy. As the saying goes. Hello Elite Farming, welcome along my friend. How are you today? 
I love looking at Giant's Bale's inside, and then the difference with some of the other mod bailings. They just aren't very good at all. Did you see the FSL? I did. I was actually at work all weekend, so I didn't get to see much of it at all. Uh, tried to catch up where I can. What's my favourite map? Oh lord. Um, this is rapidly becoming one of them. I have a group of favourites. Meadow Grove. Meadow Grove, when the uh, extension comes out, will be phenomenal. That'll be really, really good. Uh, Oakfield Farm's always a favourite. Done a lot of work on that. In FS17, the West Coast was right up there. That was a brilliant map. Cobra Park Farm has been a long favourite of mine across all of the different platforms. Uh, oh, get round. I wonder if that was the issue. Maybe it's cutting too close to the edge. That could be it. Michael, it's been a pleasure, my man. Thank you for stopping by. Yeah, the, are they the, um... Is that the Crone and the John Deere Baylor? I have to buy my own. I'm trying to save all my money to get to uh, to buy a new field, which is going to be, depend upon which field, either 70,000 plus or about 120,000. That would be the next step. Uh, so ideally where we can save money there, because I have a round baler at the moment, but because we're doing three fields of grass, I thought it would go square just to speed the job up a little bit. Yeah, Carmson's going to be a great map. That looks really good. Ooh, I like the sound of that, Adam. Uh, Dara, I don't know. I would assume yes, because it's coming with seasons. Um, but I don't know. I'm, trust me, it's going to be... You're going to want to do it because it's going to be epic. So many more fields there. So what we'll do, we'll finish this, we'll take this back over to the field where the mower is and we'll leave it there so we can get field 21 done next time round. But yeah, we're really kind of getting into a bit better position. I think we might be able to use that mower, just we were in the wrong area of the field. So we'll give that a go. But yeah, we've got some more bales that we can certainly get pulled away soon. What do you mean edit your videos on? Uh, I'm not quite sure what you mean there. If you mean what platform do I use? I use Premiere Pro. Ooh, nice, Paul. Oh, that sounds pretty cool. Paul Vin, it's been a pleasure, my friend. Thank you ever so much. Lone Oak's a beautiful looking map. It really is. Absolutely stunning. Matt, welcome along. How do you change the textures? So the textures, I think I did a video on it. You need to change it in the, the game file. But you need to change it in there. Uh, I think I did a video on it. I can't quite recall. Um, but yeah, that's what you have to do. Uh, so you need to go into your program files on your computer. And then you need to go to... Uh, I'll tell you who has done the video. Gav8080 has done a video on it. Hello, Murphy Farming. What is going on, buddy? Uh, yeah, if, uh, Paul, if you could get Gav 8080's, uh, I think he has a video of soil textures. If you're able to get that, that'd be great. If not, no worries. But yeah, it's a how-to and a walkthrough to do that. Gav does some great videos like that, so definitely worth checking out. How are you, Murphy Farming? What's going on today? You got the biggest class combine, nice. Uh, 
Ah, uh, no worries, Paul. That's cool. Come on up the hill. We're really getting some hours in on this uh, tractor today. Uh, elite farming, I would say yes. Uh, I find that some have a little bit more detail in them. It's just what I'm used to. It's just what I farmed on as well, so it's kind of it just makes the most sense to me, really. Like, I just find this map to be beautiful. Really, really nice, actually. Okay, so we're going to park this over there. And then we'll just have a little bit of an experiment to see if the mower will work. What's my favourite uh, class deal DLC? Nikki, I would say... The class Aryan 600 is a beautiful tractor, I really like that one. Old habits exactly elite, exactly. Oh, it's going to be great, Paul. It's going to be phenomenal when you guys get this. Oh, nice elite, whereabouts in the UK? Hey, we've got 56 people in here still, that's wonderful. Now, what we might do, actually. Uh, we're going to have to do the same thing again because we need to put the rake back on. You need Sussex, nice! What would I do if I could not play FS at all? Ooh, this isn't bad thinking about. That'd be pretty boring. Let's leave you there for now. What's my favourite map, Robert? Uh, right now, favourite map, like favourite map that's out. Uh, it's between, it's between this and Shamrock. I would say are my absolute favourites uh, that I'm currently playing on. Sharwell is a very close second. That's a beautiful map by Lancy. Uh, but favourite map of all time ever? Well, I don't know about that one. Um, I'd say maybe. Favorite map of all time, uh, Culver Park Farm probably. I guess that. Shamrock, the lighting on Shamrock guys is just nuts. Oh, there we go. So, stop, 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 stop. You know, we're just gonna kill two birds with one stone here and get some more work done. Uh, is there a problem on here with slurry trigger not liking mod tankers? Um, I've not actually tried it. It could well be the case, yes. Dara, it's been a pleasure. Thank you so much, my guy. Adibu as well. Thank you very much. Enjoy the rest of your day, whatever you're getting up to. Okay, that's on there. That's on there. Alright, let's get some work in here, I think. That would be the easiest way to go. So you can see how large the border is on this field. It's massive. Really big. Ah, uh, oh well, we'll do it this way. Uh, do you like a map that has small fields? I like a map that has a, a mixture of fields. That's always key. I want uh, a whole different size and shape of fields. So like this one. Some medium sized, some really small paddocks, some bigger fields as well, so you can use all sorts of equipment. We do some more Cumber contracting again, we'll definitely do some again. When? I don't know. Uh, whenever VF and I can align our schedules to work, sadly. Uh, which is not right now, but yeah, we'll definitely do it again. CPF 17 with Oakfield and FS 19. Yeah, this is the. 
I, I'm going to be very interested when Greenwich Valley gets the consoles, which hopefully it won't be too far away, but when it does, I'll be very interested to see how well it, it's downloads figures. How long left in the stream? Trish, what we might do now, now that I've realized we can mow this, I might get this mowing and we'll get... Follow me is raking it as well, so we'll get that done. Uh, once the raking's done, then I can... Uh, I can return the rake and the baler and the or the rake, the mower and the tractor and be happy with that. Or go and park them back at the store at least or something like that. And then yeah, we can kind of progress on a little bit more. Hello Eddie and Ellis, welcome along guys. We've been busy. We've been busy. We've got a lot of mowing done, a lot of baling. Uh, wrapped some silage bales as well. So we've made some great progress. But welcome along anyway. Thank you for stopping by guys. How many likes are we on? What's our magic number right now? I'm making short with this feeling. Please to double check that actually, because it would have been a bit of an effort not to have this. Ian, you're back. The mind. Thank you for uh, stopping by anyway. Enjoy the rest of your day, whatever you get up to. You're on 40 likes, that's pretty cool. If, let's see if we get up to 50. There's 53 of us here. If you haven't done so already, do smash that like button. Oh, Paul, the West Coast. That was glorious. That was really good. If you were going to play This Is Island again, how would you do it? Good question. Um, I'd probably, I might try that cattle farm go up there for a little bit and have some fun on that farm see what that looks like uh, but yeah I'd probably start with that and after that who knows problem with it this way it is gonna want to uh... okay we'll use this last little headland here I don't want to disturb those main two headlands I want to leave them as they are so we're gonna try and do it this way instead 48 people watching that's pretty cool still let's see if we can uh, get close to the 50 likes and right now we're just gonna keep taking up this last little, little headland Like this field would have taken forever with essentially a third of the moon with So Eddie, that 30 that 7810 is from Yesmont. Uh, nice and easy. It is uh, if you just go yesmonts.com and search through their, their trackers, you'll find it. It's on one of the first pages actually. It's really not far away. That's the easiest way to go. Never been able to drive a tractor this way around. Love to give it a go. It's pretty cool. So we'll use this one as kind of like the the screw up headland. Main problem being that guy's on follow me there, so he's never going to stop lifting up his. Uh, Lift up his rake there. Is Dagwin in the stream? I would probably say no, I haven't seen him. I know sometimes he does like to hang around and lurk in people's streams, but I don't think he's ever been in mine. He may well be. Thank you, Landy Boy. It's a good one. It's working well. Um, I'm quite proud with how that's coming along. I just did another episode today, uh, which will be coming on Wednesday, actually, so make sure you keep an eye out for that one. Uh, but no, that's pretty cool. I do like the, the way that's shaping up. 
Do I watch that when I do? Yes. I do. I don't get to watch anywhere near as much as I used to. But yeah, I certainly keep an eye on this stuff. I can definitely respect the amount of work and hours that he puts into it because it takes an awful long time to make role plays and uh, his survival series takes an awful lot of time and effort, that is for sure. Okay, so yeah, we'll get this field done and then we'll leave it there, I think, for today's stream. Put all the mows on the front. I could put them on the front, but do you know what? I've never got to drive this tractor this way around, so uh, I wanted to give that a bit of a go. But you're right, I could definitely put them all on the front. Hello, multi homer. What is going on, buddy? Do I like Chainsaw 100? Chainsaw, I haven't watched too much of, I'll be honest there. Uh, I know who he is, and I know he does a lot of work with Dagwin. I haven't watched a great deal of his stuff. But he may be very good, I'll have to check him out. Man, there's going to be a lot of bales on this field. Wow, is it? Ah, we got a dislike. Splendid. There's always one. So yeah, we're not gonna. We haven't received a payday quite yet because we haven't got round to uh, to finishing any contract. But when we do, heavens, it's gonna be a, a rainfall of money coming in. Let's just try and get that squared off a little bit there. I think. Let's do that. That should do it. Are you bailing today in the stream, uh, Mark? We we've been bailing quite a bit. Yeah. We've done quite a bit of building so far. Whoa. No, I'm not quite going to get it all in one, never mind. Do you do contracting in real life or in uh, farm sim? Because both are pretty cool, I do. Working car problems are oh, multi home, that's never fun. I feel your pain on that one. That's always frustrating. I always can do that. And get this all to tidy up. Alright, that's good enough for there. Cool, Eddie. What do you drive? Okay, so let's just do a bit of that, a bit of that. like that so what we've got left to do now is we've got about 10 bales to wrap up the other field and get rid of those guys we've got uh, loads of bales over at field number one to do the same as well get those all wrapped up and carted away and then we've got this field to bale and wrap as well so lots to do uh, we're not going to get around them all today there but we'll catch that on the next episode which will likely be next Sunday uh, so we'll have to wait and see on that front. Hello to Jack Healy, welcome along. Fed 1050, what CPS, CPUs am I getting? Um, that is, I'm looking at Ryzen actually for that one. Uh, so we'll have to see. Um, but yeah, more on that later on. For now, we're going to leave it here, guys. Thank you ever so much for watching. I do hope you have enjoyed. We've been pretty busy. We've got a heck of a lot done. And we'll catch it all in the next one. 
Have yourself a great day though, whatever you're getting up to. And uh, yeah, do let me know if you have any questions or comments down below. And look out for the Aftermath episode as always. Don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe to Simulation for the Nation. Ooh, that's going to turn to hay. No, that went wrong. And we will see you all in the next one. Have yourself a great day, guys. Catch you all later.